Hello, you beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play Warhammer 40 Hey Inquisitor Prophecy, where we will go on with our wonderful priority assignment. And I am a tense, a little bit pumped since we are playing a bunker busting mission, which we haven't played in a while. It is on the decommissioned outpost LH 1112. We've learned that the heretical teachings are broadcast by unsectioned walks stations. We have triangulated the messages to a decommissioned military complex manned by a defect, defected Astra Militarum detachment. Airstrikes have been failed to destroy the Wax towers due to strong counter battery activity, um, assault the complex and dismantle its defensive grid. You are expected to mark a bunker for an aerial strike. The target is reinforced by anti-aircraft artillery, so you must take out the foot soldiers and guns first, then finish the bunker. All this taking it in stride single-handedly over seemingly pointless intrigues of the Holy Ordo. I don't think so. I think what we are doing here is very, very good, and that, of course, a auto member is going to do it. Brings, um... Well, makes it actually a success, so I think it's not a waste of time and um, no waste of our resources here as well. This is our holy duty, so to say. Okay, I still am going to take this dude down. Although I have to say, you already notice. No, finally, I know I've been talking about that in the last couple of episodes that the difficulty has increased but now finally I think it really has a tendency a little bit increased which on the other hand of course makes sense since we are progressing in this priority assignment so I would laugh if those guys would actually clump up a little tins a bit more but they obviously don't um, and I think the Inoculator there was um, um, wisely taken since two Ogrins were actually approaching us and then being at low HP um, with these punchy dudes is actually quite a good idea, I think. Alright, two more groups are, so to say, incoming, so let's quickly bring them down before they do any hurt to us. Alright, and then two or three more dudes here remain, and we are nearly at the first station to actually destroy. Okay, gunner down, that is good for us. So let's focus on the enforcer. He dropped a POTC, which is nice, but probably won't be any form of upgrade, sadly enough. Okay, this guy down. Afterwards, I will, of course, focus on the Rebel Sergeant or whatever um, enemy that actually is, since with calling that down the tarantulas, this is not an easy enemy. Although his, I would still say that his bodyguards, his Ogren bodyguards, were more powerful than himself. Okay, a critical hit with a thousand damage, of course, is absolutely amazing. Lucky us. All right, let's interact with the mortar. Hostile unit down. Rinse and repeat in the name of the emperor, of course. As usual, baby, as usual. Okay, first one down. I am wasting now a little tint a bit our buff, but well, who would have known that actually no enemy is around here? Okay, 
these guys exploded. And force her down. Ah, uh, oh, okay, good luck. Uh, good luck. That was actually a little tiny bit lucky that I destroyed the weapon officers there quite by accident. Um, this was actually not planned by myself. Okay, let's bring this one down and since we are in the middle of action here, I'm going to focus on the sergeant. Okay, this one is down. The ugly part is that there obviously is a Vox caster around, which... I, or was it a grenade? I don't even know. We were fine. Okay, since there's not any more orb orbital bombardment coming down, I assume I have mistaken a grenade for a orbital or for a Vox caster calling in orbital, orbital bombardment. Okay, it was this grenade. Okay, I see. Okay, I don't know what pushed us back there. I can only assume that it... Okay, it were the Balgrins. Alright, I get it. So we... I need to get a little bit out of harm's way. Since the knockback... Knockback action of these guys is not very cool. If one of these guys is down, that will actually help out. Okay, one is down. Second one down as well. Okay. So, situation for now, at least, is completely under control. Neat. Did I collect everything? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay, second mortar then down. Kill confirmed. Target offline. Okay, um, there are a lot of enemies behind us at our tail. I don't hope that I'm doing a little bit of a mistake in having pulled too too many enemies right here. Okay, one down. This Balgrin is going to... F okay, four shotgun guys uh, shooting at us obviously is not an easy task. Alright, they are down. Woo! Okay, good, 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 good. I was... I, I mean, it wouldn't have mattered if we would have died. But dying even in this game is not a nice experience. So if I can focus down the sergeant, everything will be fine. Alrighty, them is gone. And then the last mortar will be um, silenced and then we only have one more thing to do and that is taking down a bunker. Kill confirmed. Target offline. Well, if you could say kill, I don't know. And luckily we have fought through those of the space here. Um, I guess only if you... Ah, okay, I've overseen some enemies. Okay, confusing. But no problem for us at all. Alrighty. Then a little bit of a footpath and we are nearly at the desired location of the bunker to bring down. I assume there's going to be a larger enemy group around and of course I was right.
Okay, of course, walking into that like so is actually quite cool. Bringing down many of them enemies. Okay, one more dude there. The inoculators I am, of course, going to in ignore since we currently don't need them. Since with this rebel section, we are going to, well, have an easy target. This is just what I wanted to say. And this one gone, that means I can call in the bust. And then we are through with this assignment and we only need to take a little look at the deep pre thing coming up. Primary targets on my scans. Well done. Stand by for All right. Then we will quick, uh, quickly, 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 oh, quickly go through the deep briefing here, and then all is fine. The resistance seen at the purge site clearly demonstrates the wild nature of this heresy, more than enough to steal the resolve of any auto agent. Operation successful binary and material evidence clearly clearly indicates that the teachings originate from a self-proclaimed under Haifa prophet. All right, guys, and that right now actually already brings us to the end of this episode. And you know it, I, as usual, really, really thank you for watching. If you guys actually do have enjoyed this episode, then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe. And hopefully, and hopefully I see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day, stay frosty, bye.